Understood. Moving fast. Ready for orders. It's okay, Copper Dog. What's up, huh? Oh, big punch. Phoenix Hawk does it. Takes off a leg. Nice. Yeah, it's gonna be all locusts in this quick draw. <laughs> I don't know what the vehicles are. Light damage. Holding firm. Waiting for orders. Move back in here. Although we're about to say heck with it. Um, actually, I'm gonna do multiple shots because this guy is a bad LRM shot. Let's put the LRMs over here. Right torso, right arm. He's getting trouble. Dump the quick draws. He had an LRM explosion. Wow, he has no ammo armor on him. Paper thin. Look at that. We got a headshot. We could get a... Uh... I'm kind of thinking we run the Wolverine up here after this guy. I was thinking of finishing that guy off, but we could finish this guy off. And he ejected. I don't remember what our salvage is like, but we might be able to get a quick draw. That worked out. I love it when they put in those things. And that is the nice thing about the Raven. When you get these missions with the big paper thin heavy and you can get there under his guns and then just finish him before he has a chance to do anything. That's freaking awesome. So it does definitely help with that type of mission because he didn't get a shot at us. Of course, now our... You know what? I don't need to go anywhere. Not a great target for the LRMs. We didn't have anything... I guess I could have gone after that guy. He probably wouldn't have been a great target either. Yes, Commander. But he wouldn't have been inside minimum range either. All right, so that guy's out. That gets us back our cloak. Tango down. And now we lost it again. <laughs> Goes in the back of the Wolverine. That's fine. Wolverine can handle that. What's up, boss? Stomp on him with the Phoenix Hawk. There we go. One for the scrappy. Well, Stalker moves up there, but that's okay. I think we can. Pretty effectively take care of him here. I copy. Fire. There we go. Is that it? Everybody done? Mission successful. I have to play with game volume. I think I can run it higher on my end speaker wise for me to listen to because of the new mic I think is going to be a lot more Less sensitive to, to sound from behind it. Um, I think I can get away with it a little bit more without any kind of bleed over. Which would be nice. Because I like the sound of most of the games. I think we take the two. One. Ah, we only have one. We'll take the one. Hope we get the other. Nope. But that's okay. We're starting our quick draw. That mission went pretty smooth, really. Pretty happy with that. Almost as easy as shooting down a cicada. Wait till you get to the city that defends itself by just chucking desks at your cicada, Pope. You get one of those big, heavy metal, like, government contract desks, man, that's the end of your cicada. Uh, five days on the Griffin. Let's see, we got one more mission we want to do, did we think? Yeah, um... 
That's an escort. I'd rather just do the battle. They both pay. This witness does so well, but it's an escort. Um, still, actually, the raven would be good for the escort because you could just keep them on top of. You just keep him in the middle of them. That's not a terrible idea. But I think I'm going to go for the battle. Uh, Raven's out because it's injured. We'll go ahead and put the Clint in. Swap these guys out. Um, Angel in. Larian in. Slickson in. And how about Countess? Maybe should have put the Countess in the Clint again to be able to split up those two shots for the breaching shot, but I guess we could do it with the medium lasers and the... Oh, we could sw swap... We could put the LRMs on different targets, I guess. Assuming they're in cover. Been a slow day, but we've had... We've had viewers all day. I mean... You know, for affiliate, I just need to average three. We had six kind of instantly. We've kind of been seven to eight since then. So we don't hit the heights that we've hit some days, you know, where we sit around 14. But I'm fine with six or seven. It's plenty for what I need. Hopefully it's plenty for you guys. Command interface initiated. And we are up to... What are we up to? We're up to 36 followers, by the way. So... 50 is what you need for affiliate, so 14 more. So we're on pretty good pace for that. Thank you guys, appreciate the follows. If you are not following and you would like the notifications is when we go live, um, then don't forget to follow. Copy that. Um, yeah, I may as well head up here on the hill with the Clint as well, get some elevation. Same with the trebuchet, and run the wolverine right down the middle Moving there. Out. Yep. Roger. Got it. Oh, we got a contact. Got Where? Up there. Okay. So even trying to get high, we're still not as high as that guy. Ah, well, that's that's a good reason, Wookie. You do not need to apologize. What are you playing? See, look, I'm going to distract you from your game now. <laughs> Orders. That's an excellent reason. I copy. The only one is the only one whose job it is to talk in this stream is me. That Phoenix Hawk just got rocked. It's a good thing we're in cover. Here we shave Phoenix Hawk. Wow, it's looking remarkably like our Lance, huh? But they're both in cover, so we may as well kind of split them. We'll do one on each. Evade the cover, because if we put them both on them, we actually do probably less damage, right? Because we'll be doing two or three. I think in this case, it actually... That hurt. Large laser out of nowhere. Um, I get the Wolverine... Our biggest problem is get the Wolverine out of stuff. Uh, well, how have you been doing? Because I tried it last night. It sees my controller in that when it's plugged in, it lets me pick the gamepad, but it will not see it in game. I can't use it. And I'm just using an Xbox controller. Um, but it refuses to see it. And when I try to control with the mouse, whenever I'm piloting, I'm trying to dogfight. It just, it's so all over the place as far as the sensitivity goes that it's been worthless. So I've really had a hard time with it, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, the first one. Oh, okay. The first one is, um, yeah, not nearly as issue with that. I like, I played the first one. I think I even did some YouTube videos on it, but I did it in beta. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of kind of the 2D combat system. So, but no, for that, yeah, the mouse and keyboard work just fine for that one. Um, is he... 
He's in the trees too. I, I guess we keep splitting things up till they get out of the trees. Look at that. They got a Phoenix Hawk, a Wolverine, and a Trebuchet. They are just copying us. That's all they're doing. Completely ripping us off. Um, so anyway, I played it a bunch during beta, but I didn't play it after it went live. I just wasn't, I say. There were a couple games out that were doing that same similar 2D kind of um, World of Warship style combat, which is fine with your ships on an ocean, but... Come on, send me a real mech warrior. We punch him? Is that trees? Yeah, I think we punch him and go in the trees there. But the atmosphere of both the games, with the music and the acting, is really top-notch. The new one, too, when you go to the bar, you can play 8-ball, and it's like a full pool table game in there. They also have a dice game and... Um, uh, something else. Poker, maybe? I've only done the dice and the, the pool table thing so far. Losing lots of armor. You can. And the new one, too, they made it so that there is a stream-friendly music option because they don't have the licensing for most of the songs in the first one to put on YouTube, so you will get copyright striked in no time. Um, let's see, also... You know what? We're going all in. Let's see if we can finish him off. The music in that and the music in StarCraft were both great, where they got kind of that hillbilly, blues, rock stuff going on. Really, really awesome selection. Come on, that guy needs to die. He's knocked down, but he just... Look, he's got nothing left. <laughs> we just haven't hit anything critical yet. And our guy's now stressed and unsteady, so I think we need to... Um, Vigilance. Maybe back up a bit and just laser him. It will take off a leg. Oh, ammo explosion. We didn't hit the leg. They're keeping the pressure up on our Phoenix Hawk, though. Yeah, we'll punch him. 75% chance. We'll give it a shot. Right leg destroyed. That's good. Knock him down. That make life really easy for us. Comparatively. He's still in cover, but maybe we do a split shot. Maybe we put one set of missiles on him and everything else on this guy with the, uh, with the Treb. Man, they just, they zero in on that Phoenix Hawk. I guess the lighter weight. Waiting for orders. Um... I'm going to try for the other leg. There we go. We got it. And just everything on this guy. He's out of out in the open. Look at that trebuchet hiding back there in the woods. Went after the Clint. Interesting. Um, he's still out in out in the open, so I think we still just keep raining LRMs down on him. He's passed a stability check here, but I think we end that right here with a punch. Should get yeah. There's the knockdown. I haven't taken anything off of him yet, oddly enough. But he is knocked down, so that is an injury. So maybe we get decent salvage from that. Um, and our Wolverine's out in the open, so their trebuchet is something. Um, this is the... Okay, so what they've said is that the automated system doesn't recognize some of it as stream-friendly. Or let me put it this way. That the licensing on that the, the the production companies for those songs still have them up for the auto tagging, so you might get auto tagged, but if you um, fight it, 
it should get overturned right away. Um, so you just have to say, hey, this is what I was playing, and they'll go, okay, it's good. The problem is you don't make any money on it while that's happening, or they make your money, because the whole YouTube copyright thing is just so horribly broken and balanced towards just random calls. Now, they are supposed to say exactly where it is and stuff, but it's really aimed against you. So Co may just say it's not worth my time and effort to fight against it. Um, I don't know, but that's what what the web page says for the for the game. So, I don't know. Okay, I'm on it. But yeah, it is Got past the armor. It is apparently still getting you some some fake strikes that are fightable. I should have just gone for the other torso. I've seen taking the legs off, but So yeah, I don't know. I I have sat down to record like four times and the game isn't consistently save your setup. You have to do your setup stuff when you log into the game. So when you first hit, it brings up a little screen. And you say, okay, I want this and this and this. And you set them and you go in. But then when you come back to play the game, it resets some of those randomly, as far as I can tell. So, um, so we, you know, I'll get in and I'll get it all set up, but then I'll find something wrong or something weird will happen in OBS and I'll have to back out and then I'll go back in and it will reset something different. And then when I did just say hell with it, I'm just gonna play it for myself last night. I really had trouble. It just won't, it just, it sees my my gamepad, but it won't let me use it. And the mouse and keyboard are just super oversensitive um, in the game at like normal stuff to, to use in combat. So I'm kind of frustrated at the moment. I might just let it sit for a week and then come back in? I don't know. Do kind of annoyed at it at the moment. It looks great. XPG or XP Gamer played it a bunch. Um, his stuff is up on YouTube and he's not having problems apparently. Um, but, and it, it recognized his, his gamepad right away. He didn't have any problems with it, so. And I'm just running a stock Xbox one, so I don't know why I'm having problems, but. Something about my setup's not good. I might play with it on stream one night. Maybe I'll just hit, fire up Twitch and aye, aye. see if I can get it to work. Um, where is this guy here? I haven't. I haven't. Nope. Spent very little time outside of that. Uh, you can play mouse and keyboard. I mean, it... It's supposed to be good either way. Um, I say it's just the mouse sensitivity. There may be a setting in the game, too, for mouse sensitivity um, just for that game. It's entirely possible. Um, there should also be a way to target lock, but it doesn't actually tell you what it is in the tutorial. It just says, hey, when you're when you're target locked and you hold right mud and down, it will automatically follow your target. But it doesn't actually tell you how to target lock. Oh, on your keypad, on your gamepad. Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh, I might take a look at that. That'd be nice, because I could use that for other things. I'm writing that down. That's a good tip. Thank you, Wookie. That's a great tip. Yeah, they say to use it, but then if they don't natively support an X-pad, an Xbox pad for a computer, it's just dumb. I don't, to be fair, particularly like Xbox controllers, I much prefer... A PlayStation one, but to get the PlayStation to work over oh, on a PC is such a pain in the ass. Again, you have to use kind of emulators to, to make the computer think you have an Xbox one, essentially. Um, and I don't have Bluetooth on my motherboard, so it makes it even more of a pain in the ass. Um, X-Patter. I'm just making excuses, that's all. I'll be honest with you, a lot of stuff that bugs me now wouldn't have been a problem for me 10 years ago, but with uh, the mental health issues I have at the moment, if I get frustrated early, I really have a hard time. I just get frustrated and then don't fight my way through it. <laughs> and stuff like this is so minimal in importance that I have a hard time worrying about it too much. I did, however, um, 
That's fine. Um, I did do a, get a YouTube series, five just five episodes, um, finally recorded for um, Cliff Empire. So if you're interested in that, check out the YouTube. YouTube. Um, and it's just Mellow 7 Gaming on YouTube as well. Uh, it's a pretty cool little city builder, kind of post-apocalyptic. There's like a, a haze of of nuclear fallout mist that goes to you know a certain level and so they've they've constructed these cliffs these artificial platforms to get up above that and now they're now you build your cities on there but it's a fairly difficult city builder if you play with like natural disasters and stuff on um anyway it's fun it's got a kind of a cool look i am old and grumpy <laughs> i'm not sure that's quite the issues i've had that are that are causing it at the core but um we get a phoenix hawk and a wolverine out of this But it does bug me when the kids are on my lawn, so maybe. We've, we've just kind of quietly rolled through. The, I mean, it's almost five o'clock now. Quietly rolled through three hours. Six to eight viewers. I'm assuming Freddy Bot is a bot. Hey Virgo Pros, how you doing today? I don't remember if I said hi to Tim Tob or not. Hey Tim Tob, how you doing? Welcome back. Uh yeah, I think we built I don't know which one I want. Hold on a second. Let me check Sarna. I wish you could mouse over and it would tell you what they are. Um, we're looking about Wolverine 6R versus 6K, right? Um, Wolverine, Wolverines, um, variants, uh, 6K, the Draconis Combine one, remove the jump jets, keeps the head laser, SRM, replaces auto cannon with a large laser, medium laser, and small laser. Um, and then the 6R doesn't exist. Is it a 3R? According to Sarna, there's not such thing as a 6R. There's a 3R that was a primitive. Hmm. See, maybe apocryphal variants is that uh and the quarantine from the game okay no ideas i guess we'll go for the k minimize that so i can see everything else like real thumbstick so it reacts more or less depending on oh that's nice so you actually get you actually get analog control on your analog stick. Yeah, I don't see what the 6R is, but we'll go with the 6K. That one sounds cool. I'm good with that. Uh, build the Phoenix Hawk. We might just keep the Phoenix Hawk down. I don't feel the need to, to build that one, but that Wolverine actually sounds pretty cool. I mean, it's an energy build, um, but we may as well bring that one up. It's bigger than some of these other mechs we've got. So if we go to storage and we find our Wolverine. I mean, we're just talking hard points since they're un unequipped anyway, you know. We'll have it warmed up ASAP. But yeah, we'll bring that guy up. Um, we'd probably sit the, sit the Clint down at that point. I think. Um... All the pilots are out. Raven and Griffin are a little bit out. So let's go ahead and just hit play. And then we'll do another mission. I guess we got time for one more. Dog doesn't agree with me, but... Oh, we were going to travel somewhere too, weren't we? But we might get a new set of missions right here. Oh, I already have a 6R? Perfect. Then we're good. We'll go with the 6K for the other one. I'm glad you noticed that. I thought about it when I saw it the first time, and I completely forgot by the time I checked Sarna. Um, so we're doing okay. Let's see. Did that give us a new set of missions? Yes, but no missions we can do. 
All right, time to travel. See if there's like a something here on the border that we want to go to. Uh, maybe this one. Yeah, there's one, but it was three skull. I don't think we're we're capable of three skull. That's four skull. Definitely not capable of that. Here, let's do the F2 thing. Zoom in here. We're looking for something. Two and a half. Two. How about Castle Rain? We haven't been here in this one. I know. I think we were in there here in the last save. Arid battlefield manufacturer mining, and we could maybe get some missions against the Capellan Federation. Either for the for the pirates or for Merrick. And it's two skull, so it's still a step up from what we've been doing. That'll give us a chance to get everything built. See how that rolls. Um yeah, I think we just keep going here. Sounds like Wolverine, maybe we just do a do kind of what they said. What was that? A large, medium, small in the arm, and we can punch and we got some long range stuff going for it. Interesting that the the mech and the uh engineering changed places up there, even though they're the same number of days. The Wolverine was above it, and then they just swapped. <laughs> out of Mountain Dew, though, that might be a sign that it's almost time to end for the day. All righty. I think there's a new Black Pants um, video that was coming up today, too. Black Pants Legion, by the way. I think I saw that they were premiering one this afternoon. Maybe we have something to watch later after this is up. Um, travel to Castle Rain. Still a few more days. But let's take a look at our Wolverine, because that is done now, our new one. Let's just start by maxing the armor. And then we do have four bits. We could do double PPC on. Oh, we've only got one PPC, so I guess we can't. Um, but we could do a PPC. Maybe a couple mediums. And some heat sinks. Could go cannon and stick him in the legs. It doesn't really matter for our purposes, but something like that, and maybe we take off just enough to get us to a jump jet in case we need to get up and down a cliff. Come on. Oh, just want one, I guess. One each. That get us there. And that gets that'll get us two heat uh, jump jets. 